horrific abuser jailed for using pet dogs to fight badgers and foxes. A horrific animal abuser who used his three pet dogs to fight badgers and foxes has been jailed for six months. Callum Muir, 25, was seen in videos encouraging his dogs to attack the wild animals as they screamed in pain. He laughed as a fox's skin was torn away and ripped in half by dogs, while two of his pets attacked a fox as another man stamped on its head. The Scottish Society for Prevention of Cruelty to Animals called it one of the worst cases inspectors had ever seen. The complete disregard for the well-being of the dogs and wild animals in the videos is appalling, said one of the charity's inspectors after Muir was sentenced at Air Sheriff Court. To stay up to date with latest top stories, make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel by clicking the button above this video. Muir, from Logan in East Ayrshire, also failed to seek veterinary treatment for any of the injuries his three dogs, Terrier Pip, Lurcher Bella and Bull Lurcher Mig, sustained as a result of the fights. The organization said it was disappointed Muir had not received a longer jail term given new legislation means offenders can be sentenced to up to five years for animal welfare crimes. All three dogs were signed over to the care of the Scottish SPCA and have since found new homes. The SSPCA's Special Investigations Unit, SU, seized three dogs with significant injuries at Muir's home in Loggingate Terrace in May 2021 after a tip-off he may have been using them in animal fights. They also found evidence he was self-treating the dog's injuries to avoid authorities being alerted. Pip and Bella, the two older dogs, had injuries across their faces, necks and legs. Both dogs had several missing teeth as a result of the fights they'd been in, and the lack of appropriate veterinary treatment would have made the suffering even worse, the inspector, who has to remain anonymous, said. Mig had some scarring to her muzzle and legs, but as she was a much larger, stronger, and younger dog it's likely she'd have been able to avoid serious injury up to this point. Investigators also found several items associated with animal fighting including locator collars, which are used to track dogs when they are underground in badger sets. Officers also discovered nets for catching wild animals when they bolt from their dens. Fox and badger DNA was found after the evidence was analyzed. A number of video clips and images were also recovered showing dogs, including Muir's own pets, fighting wild animals. In my line of work you see a lot of stomach-churning examples of animal cruelty, but the videos and images relating to this case are among the worst I've ever seen," the inspector added. Given the sheer level of suffering endured by Muir's dogs, countless wild animals and the depravity of the videos and images he owned, we are disappointed he has not received a longer jail sentence. Muir has also been banned from owning and keeping animals indefinitely. The League Against Cruel Sports also worked closely with the SSPCA throughout the investigation. Robbie Marsland, director of LAX Scotland, said the organization was pleased to have played a part in bringing Callum Muir, a horrific animal abuser, to justice. He also commended the SSPCA for such a comprehensive investigation which was absolutely critical in bringing about today's result. The Scottish SPCA has urged anyone with concerns about an animal to contact its confidential helpline.